Mark, okay, uh, for your information, uh, I would like to ask all of you first. Do you know uh, how, I mean, how do you want to declare that your blood is good condition or not? Good condition? How do you want to read your blood? Blood test? I mean, do you know how uh, the, the range of the, the, which is your critical or maybe not uh, just normal or maybe you are okay? Do you know the rate? Yeah, blood cell. Red blood cell, platelet you mean? Platelet, yeah, the platelet. Uh huh. Hundred and above, consider you are fine. But below <coughs> ten. Below ten, critical. Pardon? Below ten, critical. Yeah, below ten is considered actually below thirty, critical already. Mm. Yeah. So what happened to my mom? <coughs> we just went. I mean, went back and forth more than three times until her blood pellet dropped in 30. It's still, it's already considered serious and her pee come out with blood already. So it's really critical and she will put in a break zone, which is very critical uh, zone. And you imagine yourself, if your mom, if your mom's still alive, and how would you feel if this happened to you? Were you worried? Yeah. yeah. You wanna be worried, right? Yeah. And the best part, and the most challenging part, right after my mom. No, the best part, the worst yeah, part. The worst part. Better part, <laughs> And the worst part. And the worst part. And the worst part, right after my mom, the, um, stable. It's a, uh, I mean, stable. The her palate improved, getting better. He got another news, which is my brother. Uh, get the same symptom, yeah. which is dengue, and he went to different uh, different hospital, which is private and government. You know, like yeah, veteran, right? My mom went to general, and my brother go to private because of insurance. So still, um, it's the worst thing happened, and the worst, if even worse part, we had another news. My younger sister in Kelantan, and she's the youngest. She had to pay three months alone. Nobody taking, of, uh, taking care of her, like as siblings or maybe our parents, which is for youngest uh, children, what do you, what you do not expect? You, like you, you have your own children and you have your own kids. How about your youngest daughter? Yeah. Very worried, right? But what can you do? Because we need to take care like three different people and then pregnant ladies or more. So it's very challenging. Very me. challenging. Very challenging for me. And my all my siblings. Because three of us only know more. The rest, um, I mean, facing the cha uh, challenges. Mm. Right? Okay. So this is the reason why I would like to share with all of you ways to avoid dengue. Nowadays, the dengue, I mean, news is getting even worse. It's not getting better. It's it is worse. not. It's not getting better. Even in um, for, uh, hospital clan, every single day, they are facing 250 patients in and out. Let's say you already, uh, three patients already recover, another three will come and replace. Can you imagine how worse it can be? How bad? How bad it can be. And imagine one of the patients is your family member. So that is why right now, maybe the three points that I'm going to share, it's a, like a normal thing, like maybe it's familiar for you, but nothing, but. But nothing wrong for us to start from the basic. Okay. Okay, the first point, always stay in a cool place. Cool. Because uh, air conditioning, air conditioning place, or maybe air conditioned, air conditioning, air, air conditioned, air conditioned room, room, or if you don't have air con, if in, you don't have air con, if you don't have air con in your house, or maybe your office, probably no, I mean in your house, maybe make sure your house is well, well, what. Ah, yes, contaminated. 
Ah, ha? ventilated. Ventilated. Eh, not ventilated. Well covered. Well covered. Yes. Uh, I mean at least uh, especially on a peak time because mosquitoes they love uh, I mean the most of I mean uh, they they will go out when 6 to 7 p.m. and 6 a.m. until 7 a.m. So these peak hours is actually traffic for them go in and out so some of you you don't realize when you want to you go don't school, realize you don't realize when you want to go to class maybe you want to go to work or you want to send your daughter you want to send your brother so ha huh? only edit does that ah yeah only edit only edit ah only edit mosquitoes does that So that is why you need to prevent. You need to prevent. You need to prevent from it. I mean, from happen to your family members. That is the first point. Second. I one, still don't get it. First one, do what? Air conditioner. Uh, air air con- condition. Stay in the. Uh, Ayo lah. Stay in the air condition. Ah, uh, air condition. Because ah, uh, okay. The point doesn't make it. Eh. Okay. Why? Why? Because uh, mosquitoes they don't like to. Be in a cold place, or in a well, a uh, covered place. Ah. ah. Because it's very difficult for them to enter, correct? Okay. Secondly, reschedule back. Ah, second, reschedule back your outdoor activities. Like I said previously, the traffic is actually uh for Eddie's uh mosquitoes. They they love to in and out. From eight a.m. uh seven p.m. until eight p.m. That's why you say six to seven. Ah, six, uh, six to seven. Ah. Confused. And then, uh, six a.m. to seven a.m. Uh huh. So these peak hours, you should you should avoid. Okay. Mm-hmm. And the third point. Use mosquito repellent. I mean, sometimes we just take things for granted. So when you are at home. With your family, maybe with your girlfriend, maybe with your uh, mother-in-law. Just before you sleep, make sure you spray. Make sure. Make sure you spray your room, or maybe your bathroom, your dining hall. So spray everywhere, so that at least you take some precaution. Okay, mm-hmm. so. Let me repeat the three steps. Okay. Let me repeat the three steps. <coughs> the first one, stay in a air condition, air condition place or mm. room. Well, well covered room. Uh-huh. Okay. The second one. Oh, uh, uh, reschedule your outdoor activities. Uh huh. And the third one, use mosquito repellent. So believe, guys, uh, I urge to all of you to practice this. So that it won't happen to your family members. So that you and your family members will not get dengue. Okay, so that you and your family members will, will not, not get dengue. Will not get dengue. Think.